welcome to another edition of a vlog specializing in reviewing new consumer technologies. It's J Tech. He reviews those apps. It's J Tech. I want that guy on my lap. This episode this week, we're going to review a self help app. Self help is a big business right now. Uh, ones that help you with self confidence, anxiety, insomnia, a uh, little uh, drug addiction, a little drug addiction, little drug addiction. Uh, and there's apps out there for people who think they've been abducted by aliens and there's tracking devices in their brain. It's called the Alien Brain Scan app. You should check it out. It's totally weird. Uh, however, I did find one app that kind of stood out to me. Unlike the other apps, which are designed to solve a specific problem, this claims that it can help with, in, in, with anything. You just input your goal and it sends you a series of custom tailored missions to help you accomplish it. And what's really interesting about it is an interactive feature, an interactive feature that allows you to keep track of your progress by filming yourself with your camera in order to help you accomplish the mission. The app is called iLive. I know it sounds a little weird, but it's pretty cool and it's really fun and easy to use. So here is the app, which is bright and positive and has a guy jumping into action with the tagline, you haven't lived until I lived. Whoa! Thank God I found this thing, because I'm ready to finally start living. Once you've downloaded the app inside the user agreement, you're then prompted to answer a series of questions about yourself, much like you'd find on any dating app or website. Anyway, whether you decide to answer the questions or not, you're then asked to input your goal. And what's the most important thing for a guy to have on the beach in LA? That's right, a six pack. So I entered my goal. I want a ripped six pack to share with the ladies. And I received my first mission via text message that read, Welcome aboard. You have started your journey to acquiring a six pack to share with the ladies. Oh yeah, it is on. So I set up the camera on my phone and began filming myself performing each exercise. That's me doing sit-ups, jogging, eating right. Not only do I look like a bird, now I have to eat like one too. We want protein. And now the moment of truth. I took a picture of myself before the program, just do a little before and after comparison. And here's my stomach right now. Yeah. Nothing. Not even a three pack. This is a one pack. In fact, all that broccoli just made me feel a little bit blue. Give me some gas. So. It was fun because you get to film yourself and share your pathetic dreams and subsequent struggles with the world. It's really not that effective in actually helping improve oneself. That's why I'm gonna give the app I Lived two out of five stars. It's not really worth it. Shit. What the hell, I hope I saved all that. Oh, shit. chance of you two kids getting back together? I don't think so. You should give her a call. Yeah, uh, no. She left me, remember? Well, maybe if you had a real job with some security instead of these startups. Dad, really? We sacrificed a lot to send you to Stanford. And what are you doing with it? There are no real good jobs. So, and you spend all your time online playing with gadgets and, and video games. You know I'm trying to start my own tech company, and the internet's a great place to build a following, and I'm reviewing apps because they're popular right now, and I can make tons of money on YouTube. You know, whatever. Yeah, well, all I'm saying is that you're wasting your talent. Okay, I got it. Okay, but don't forget to pray for your mother. Talk to you later.
You dare assault me! You would done far worse than I! Bear it out. No, 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 hold up. Check this out. Excuse me, your dad, Lord. Remember me? I know your ugly ass is in here. You're not sneaky. You're not gonna screw me, you douchebag. Talk about a crease of peace. I can't believe she has a big piece of peace. No, thanks for changing your mind the last minute, dick. I told you from the beginning I wasn't sure if I could move in. You can't afford that place, dude. You don't have a job. Duh, I know. Can you stop texting and watch the fucking road? Look, man, do you know how much time it takes to maintain three dating sites at once? I know, I should have never introduced you to this. Hey, speaking of which, all you big time. You mean bitches have bad using this man? The weird thing is, I kind of believe you, and then I look at your face, I'm like, there's no fucking way. <laughs> there's a way. Take care of your ass tonight, man. I got a couple of uh, European chicks lined up. You know what that means, don't you? What? Anal. You're sick. Watch the roll, watch the roll, dude. I got you up, dude. Anyway, I don't need your help, because I've actually been banging bitches on my own on the side. Oh, is that right? Yeah, man. You've been banging bitches, huh? Yeah, dude, I've been like fucking hard, dude. Hard fucking dude, up. Dude, with my dick. Wow. You've been fucking girls with your dick? Dude, That's yep. That's fucking great. Getting it in, dude. Putting it in them. Can you, can you name me one of these girls that, that you put your dick in? Jill's been getting it. Jill? Dude, That's she's... a great made-up name you did. No, she's been getting yeah. the dick, dude. You're doing your bobblehead thing. It's like a woodpecker. That's why I know you're lying. <laughs> All right, I, I just don't want to get another relationship, okay? I'm not talking about relationships, dude. I'm talking about getting that scent back on. What scent? The scent? The vagina. You're so creepy, dude. It's a scent that lets ladies know that you don't need them. Because you get laid all the time, man. Bitches love that scent. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna refocus. We're gonna hook you up with a couple of hotties tonight, man. Because I swear to God, you could do a lot better than that. My ex was super cute. No, she wasn't, man. She had a big nose. And fuck she had, you, dude. Fuck you. And she had cankles. That was debatable. Marie Helen. Bonjour, mon petit poussin. That means little chicken. It's French. Yes, this is Bobby Yen. I'll be there in a minute, baby. Okay. Okay, bye. Why are you talking with a French accent? Dude, Filipino. Oh. What did you call? I had to go to the bathroom. I was taking a piss. You go so well. Yeah, I take long, long pisses. Oh, it's... Uh, you look great, by the way. I love this thing. Oh, thanks. It's a necklace? Yeah, it's a great necklace. Thank you. Friend, she got sick. She's not showing up. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm cool. Don't worry about it. We can get the fuck out of here if you want. No, it's it's cool. You, you just know me. You cool? Better uh, watch out. Looks like some guy's moving in under the turf. All right. What the hell is that? Oh, uh, nothing. You just buy a girl a drink, dude? No, I drink these all the time. Yeah, you did. Which one? Ooh, it's hot. Hey, now's your chance. Go get it. Hey, did you see the way she's dissed that Abercrombie guy? Oh, chance, man. All those good-looking guys are gay. Now go over there and do your thing, man. Be yourself. <sighs> like a... Like a cool version of yourself, you know? The sky's the limit, you're the man, all that shit. Go get it, have fun.
I bet you were a kamikaze girl. Are you asking me if I have a death wish? No. What? The, the drink, like kamikazes? No, sorry. Okay. Sorry I asked. What, that's it? I'm sorry? You said that already. Right. Okay, uh, it's just a drink that I thought you might enjoy. That's, that's it. You could just ask a girl. Yeah, I could do that. Or are you too macho? You're the kind of guy who thinks he knows what a woman wants. Do you like to take charge with a woman? No. Wait a second. This is a trick question? Tricky question. Right, okay. Um, mm. May I offer you ladies a beverage this evening? <laughs> I'm cute. I don't know, what do you think? Come on. <laughs> no. All right. Pull up a chair. She has terrible taste in it. Good night, Josh. White Noise is the name of the app and it comes with a video option and that's why I'm gonna give it three out of five stars. <laughs> and now, I'd like to thank all of you who've been liking me on all the social networks and for all of you new subscribers. We're almost 300 strong, that is awesome! Dad, are you proud of me yet? I'm doing everything I can out here in Hollywood. I'm trying as hard as I can. All right, that's enough, Michael Caine. And this brings me back to the app that I reviewed just several days ago, I Lived. And I may have been just a little bit too harsh in my first evaluation because it's a lot more clever than I initially thought, see? I used the GPS on my phone to actually track the bar that I was in to connect me with the one key girl that I had my eye on. Not that the app had anything to do with actually knowing who that person was, but it still gave me the courage to step to that person. Yeah, exactly. So, here is a picture of my cheating ex-girlfriend. And here is a picture of the girl that the app miraculously got me talking to. It's like one is a Victoria's Secret model, and the other one's a bitch. So that's why I feel like this app deserves a little bit more in-depth analysis, or what I like to call a JTEC double take. D -d -d double take, double take. The first thing I did was click on the user reviews to see what others are saying about the app, and it linked back to the website where I found a bunch of actual testimonials. This app has totally changed my life. When I started using it about um, six months ago, 
I was afraid of everything. I was afraid of heights. I was afraid of traveling. And I just walked over the Golden Gate Bridge. Um, I've lived here my whole life and I'm terrified of heights and I did it. It changed me. I mean, it totally changed my life. All right. And there's this guy. Woo! I'd always wanted to be a pilot. So my God and I lived, and now here I am landing a B-17. And it's all because of I live. Ma vie a changé depuis que j'ai téléchargé à Lift. Vous allez voir, vous allez faire des choses merveilleuses, vivre des choses incroyables. I lived. Weird. There's a lot of wackos using this thing, just like every other app, but it actually seems to be working for a lot of people. So I'm finally ready to start taking this thing seriously and enter a new goal. Make Greta my new girlfriend. Because making out with a chick in a bar is one thing, but cl cl closing the deal is a whole nother animal. <coughs> and could be a big job for I live. Okay. Incoming message. Girls like nice guys. Do something nice for six people. All right. Let the experiments begin. I'm signing off. But until then, I'm Josh. This has been JTEC. Peace, peace, peace. Out. You've been there all day. You got to check the spot. Time for you to go. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, please. Thank you for your help. Can I help you across the street real quick? Uh, no. Are you sure? Yeah, sure. Hey, hey. What's up, Stop down. Who are you? I just want to help. Alright, that definitely didn't work. Who wants some candy? Here's the lollipop for the big boy. celery, onions, and carrots in here to saute. We're going to bring it back. This should be called and the cougar cooking class, because, you know. <laughs> now, remember, this is a very, very male dance. We have to be very strong. Okay, round. Very good. One hour to mash this enjoy. 
Oh, furious, oh, can find me not. What is this that frees me so in storms? What do my shouts amid lightnings and raging winds mean? Oh, savage! Oh. Hey, man, we're trying to have some coffee here. That's Walt Whiteman, you jerk. First of all, it's Whitman. What, man? Uh, what, man? Whitman. It's Walt Whitman. Whatever, dude. No culture in L.A. <laughs> That's crazy. I live the exact same thing. Yeah, well, no more blind faith for me when it comes to matters of the heart. Well... <laughs> I'm not gonna let some crazy narcissist ruin it for all the good girls out there. Oh, so you're like a philanthropist? No, 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 no. Uh, more like a humanitarian and a poet. Oh, really, a poet? One hour to madness and joy. Oh, furious, oh, can find me not. What is this that frees me so in storms? What do my shouts amid lightnings and raging winds mean? Oh, to drink the mystic delirium deeper than any other man. Oh, savage and tender achings. Oh, to be yielded to you, whoever you are, and you to be yielded to me in defiance of the world. <laughs> oh, to return to paradise. Oh, bashful and feminine. Oh, to draw you to me on you for the first time the lips of a determined man <laughs> oh to be absolved from previous ties and conventions i from mine and you from yours oh madness in us oh, <laughs> to drive free to love free to dash reckless and dangerous <laughs> to court destruction with taunts <laughs> with invitations <laughs> to ascend to leap to the heavens of love indicated to me. To rise thither with my inebriate soul. To be lost if it must be so. To feed the remainder of life with one hour of fullness and freedom. With one brief hour of madness and joy. One? Two? checklist to keep track of all those hot, steamy, sexy positions, as well as a rating system for your performance. Imperative for any man, except me. Cause I am a jaguar in the sheets. That's why I give Kama Sutra Love Journey four out of five stars. And to the makers of this app, you had me at sex position. And for those of you who have commented on my Facebook status from going to single to in, in, in a relationship, sorry ladies, I'm not available. I'm off the market now. You're probably noticing that the app I lived, the experiment that I've been doing, is going pretty well. <sighs> and by the increasing number of users who have downloaded the app, it looks like it's going pretty well for you guys too. <laughs>
There have been some updates to the website, most notably the private setting, just in case you're a little bit too embarrassed to show the world what you're willing to do to better yourself. It's a shame from this reviewer's standpoint because it provided hours of great comedy. Now, I'm going to put the app to the test with this next goal. Get one million viewers. No. Eight million viewers! Viewers! <laughs> Might I say that this is a person dressed for success? It's almost a perfect fit. Just a little bit on the inseam of the sleeves, and the world is yours to take looking like that. How much is it? This one's 2300 and you're looking at about 2700 with alterations. Okay. Yeah. Do you uh, have something in a different fabric, maybe a bit darker? I think I may. Yeah, let me take a look. What do you think? Hot. You think? Yeah, babe. If you want to dress for success, that's the way to do it. Do you mind getting the car while I pay for this? I gotta get back to work. You're getting it? You said hot, right? Like I want that guy hot. Seriously, get the car. Get it, man. Real tough guy, huh? Hey, listen here, little lady. Fucking weirdo. It's not even raining. Hey, man, you got some weird ass. Nick sure. Money for coffee sounds great. All right, cool. See you then. Some guy out of the UK is in town wants to give me a job at this major tech site. They said they're going to pay me a salary. Nice. Now maybe you can quit hiding in your own house. Always be firm and stand your ground. That's the spirit. That's a good one. I may use that one, Josh.
Dude. There's a line. Yeah, and? You just cut it. What are you gonna do about it? It's cool, man. Yeah, I thought so. Are you Joshua? Yes. Sit, sit. Just Josh is fine. Josh from JPEG. I'm Roberto Luis and I love your little show, man. Gotta tell you. Love how you mix your personality with the reviews. It's fresh, it's personal. And most of all, it really inspires trust in your audience. Coffee? I'm good, I can. And let's face it, we're all trying to sell something. Advertising, technology, entertainment, right? Are you the only writer? Yeah, just me. Okay. Well, I may have an interesting proposition for you, mate. How would you like to have your own show on a site that has over 8 million viewers worldwide? Did you say 8 million?
What are you doing? Where's mom? Rushed out of there. I uh, just wanted to be alone with you. Okay, good. Me too. Hello? This is yes. That's great. Of course I have a lawyer. Sure, I'll do that. Okay, great. Talk to you later. I guess I have to find a lawyer. Hey, what's up? It's so late. What's going on? Are you guys okay? Praise the Lord. The doctors can't explain it. They said they think she's in total remission. It's a miracle. Complete reversal in three weeks. What? How is that possible? I don't know. Last week she was in such pain that she wanted to take her own life. She wanted to kill herself? Why didn't you call me? I wanted to help her do it. So shame saying I love her so much. I know you love her, Dad. No, she's gonna be okay. She's gonna be alright. Son, the Lord is rewarding us. I can't believe it. You go back to sleep. I love you, son. Ted, who, who's at the house with you? Just me and your mom. It's four o'clock in the morning. Dad, I can see someone sitting at the sofa chair. Greta? I didn't upload the video. What? The video. Or the app. I usually have to upload the video and then things happen. I got the job and I didn't upload the last video. You got the job because you weren't talented. And because you know your stuff. 
Not because of some stupid app. Come back to bed. Are you done with it? What's great about this app is you can access all your cameras right from your phone anywhere in the world. So let's say you're going out of town and you're leaving your kids behind because you don't want to take them. Or maybe you got that wife that's creeping around, she's cheating, you can check on her too. Or maybe you got somebody that might be breaking into your house. Well, you can check on your house from anywhere in the world. That's what's pretty cool about this. There's also a look, 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 loop feature which allows you to flip from camera to camera without even doing anything. And that's why I give this app four out of five stars. Which brings me to my next announcement. Yours truly, JTech is about to make a huge deal with the enormous tech site, Checker.org. I'm gonna be hosting their app review show. Bling, 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 because I'm gonna be actually getting paid money, dollar, dollar bill. Bling, 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 bling. Now hold up, hold up, hold up. I know some of you purists out there are like, Josh. You selling out, okay? Because you're not gonna be a little JTEC anymore. You're gonna be big JTEC. And I get it, okay? I'm not selling out. Because you guys are gonna be part of a much larger network of dorks around the world, around the world. Oh, and for those of you who have been following the I Lived App experiment, check this out, motherfucker. Yeah! Six bad bitches. I'm Josh from JTEC. Peace out, bitches. I do a lot of push ups when I'm in my spare time. That's all I do. Hey, what's up, man? This is a great party, huh? Yeah, check this is out. Hey, have you seen Greta? Greta? Like she looks like. Whoa, excuse me. I have a straight You want to get out of here? Absolutely. Can you give me a second? Two minutes. Josh. Come on. You're a great guy and I have a lot of fun with you, but... I made myself pretty clear. No strings attached, remember? No, I don't remember. What did she think this was gonna be, really? Nothing. Whatever. You're hurt. We're all good.
Joshua Fossey. He was supposed to call and talk to me about the terms of my... Well, can I talk to him? Can I help you? Yeah, uh, hi. Uh, Mr. Luis, please. He's unavailable. I told you that on the phone. No, you said he didn't know me. I've been calling for like three days. How do you... Is that his office there? Please, I don't want to have to call security. Who is that? Sir? Who is he meeting with in there? Mr. Luis! Mr. Luis! Mr. Luis! Roberto! Come on, man. Just chill out. I won't have to call the cops. Why don't you chill out? Why don't you all just chill out? Somebody broke into my garage. What is your address? 233 North Norton Avenue. Hello? Hello? Detective McQueen, this is my card. If the guy comes back, 
give me a call. All right. Dad, what's going on? I'm at the hospital. Where's mom? She's in the ICU. I thought you said she was getting better. We need to pray, son. You said she was getting better. She was. I don't know what happened, but she took a turn for the worst. How bad? She's in a coma. Pray with me, son. Will you stop with that? You're always praying for her. What has that ever gotten you? I'm scared. I know the feeling. Please pray with me, son. I'm gonna hang up now, okay? craziest shit that I've ever heard. I think you might want to lay off the computers for a while. I saw this guy following me. He was at my house. It's the same guy in my parents' house. A guy in a black trench coat teleported from your parents' house in Michigan to your house through Skype? Teleporting? Fucking serious, dude. I mean, I don't know, man. Did you read the user agreements? What did I sign? I'm just messing with you, man. No, it makes sense. No, it doesn't. You didn't sign your soul away on your iPhone, all right? I'm gonna break it down for you. Here we go. Greta, she's out of your league. She's smart. She's older. She has money. She's fucking hot. I mean, she's probably uh, just geeking it. And this UK website thing, right? It's a startup, so it's worth a billion dollars today, and then tomorrow they're bankrupt. And your mom, dude, I'm sorry to say this, but she's been terminal for almost a year now. I mean, you told me back then, she'd be lucky to make it past three months. So, I don't know what this thing's doing to your head, but it's not responsible for what's happening in life. You are. This thing is real. Sometimes, I'm banging like a really hot model. 
and it feels real. But then I'm like, oh shit, I'm masturbating. On the internet, that's what you're doing. You're masturbating, man. I don't need you for this, I'll do it on my own. No, you won't, hey, hey, look, you're about to commit a very serious felony right now, right? This isn't like uh, stealing suits or giving kids candy. I think I, I think I have a better idea. There's a way we can do this cleanly. What do you know about kidnapping someone? Dude, Filipino. I'm so thirsty. Are you sure you don't want anything? It's totally on me. They have like the best chai latte. Um, mm. Have you talked to Bobby yet? I tried calling him to let him know we're done, but he's not answering. Anyway, I've never played a kidnapping victim before. Do you think I could get a copy of that for my reel? Or, you know, I could get it off YouTube as well. Are you alright? Josh? What's the matter? Oh my god. Oh my god, where where are you? Okay, okay. Bobby, he's been in an accident. I mean, he's he's at the hospital, Josh. <sighs> Hey guys, it's Josh from JTech. Got a great bunch of reviews for you to share. Me to share with you today. Uh, I see a lot of you have unsubscribed from my vlog. I uh, understand it's okay. You're probably waiting for that new link to my new show that I promised you. Well, I decided to go on another 
direction. I didn't want to be a corporate sellout and be selling somebody else's product, if you know what I mean. Anyway, first app that we're gonna review today, let me let me get my list real quick. Go. Here's the list, okay. First app I'm gonna review is all about First app that Damn it! What now? What? What? Hello, Josh. I'm sorry to disturb you. I was just wondering if you were able to pay your rent. Really? Is that why you gave me an eviction notice? I'm sorry about that, but it has been three months. I just need a little bit more time. I'll get it to you soon. I just got a new job working online. Online? Josh, I have a lot of people who are ready to pay some real money for this house. It's always about the money, isn't it? Oh, I know things have been hard on you since you broke up with your girlfriend. She was such a nice girl. It's too bad. Josh, I didn't know you graduated from Stanford. Oh, your parents must be so proud of you. Oh, wow. Even though things haven't exactly panned out for you. By the way, how is your mother? Is she still dying? What are you doing? Dog, you never let me. Yeah. Well, I didn't feel like living with two bitches. You don't have to be mean about it. When you mean mean, you mean like bringing other guys into our bed? Guy, not guys. Huge difference for me. And besides, I always told you I was on the fence about us. Well, you're outside the fence now, so you can just go. How'd you even get in here? I still have a key. I told you I was coming to get my last box. All right. There it is. Take it. Josh? What? I'm very busy right now. I just wanted to apologize for the way I treated you. Good. Hope you feel better about yourself now. I should have never left the way I did. I'm glad you did. 
Don't you miss me? Even a little bit? This is nuts. Why are you so angry? Because you cheated, lied, stole, and dumped me like a piece of shit when there was nothing left to take. Now take your box and get the fuck out. What happened to you, Josh? Why? Because I'm not getting used and pushed around by you anymore? Good. I love you. the way I treated you. Rains of pores. I know it's stupid to cry like this. No, I, I didn't mean it like that. I just didn't expect things to go so far between us. What? And I think I really fell for you because I got scared too and then I'm just gonna go. Wait. And I know it doesn't mean anything anymore, but I didn't sleep with him. Josh, any girl would be lucky to be with you. Yeah. I've been expecting a call. So, thank you guys so much for watching. This has been JTech signing off for Tekker TV. Peace out. Did I tell you or did I tell you? I mean, look at that face. Is that not the face of technology? Of the future? You can trust this face. I know I do. It's great. Beautiful face. Is mom better? How did you know? I just had a feeling. Someone here wants to talk to you. Hi, baby. It's okay. Mom's okay. The doctors say they think I'm gonna be just fine. It's the darndest thing, isn't it? I love you, Mom. I love you too, sweetheart. I'm gonna visit really soon. I'm, I'm sorry I haven't been there for you. Don't you worry about me. You just take care of yourself. I know I'm in your prayers. I love you. I'll be right back. Lord. I won't lie to you, she's in a lot of pain, but they say that she's gonna live. I 
tell you we have a guardian angel looking over this family, Josh. How else can you explain it? Thank the Lord, blessed be thy name. Dad, Mom is standing behind you. What are you talking about?
with lowliness is young ambition's ladder, where to the climber upward turns his face. But when he reaches the utmost round, unto the ladder he turns his back, looks to the sky, scorning the base degrees by which he did ascend. Hello, Joshua. What is this? Who are you? What do you want from me? If memory serves me right, it was you who came looking for me. You needed help with a young lady, Greta. Holy shit. The app. I lived. Are you the developer? In a sense. Are you unsatisfied with the product? How does it work? Like all apps. Series of equations, fractions, numbers. An algorithm designed to solve a specific problem. Fulfill a need. That's the definition of technology. From fire, to the wheel, to the internet. Technology's made the world a better place for you, has it not? This is different. It's like it knows me. It knows you, Josh. Because you've uploaded everything about yourself. Likes, dislikes, fears, hopes, photos, videos, intimate thoughts and desires. I want it to stop. Stop? Why would you want it to stop? Hasn't it given you everything you've asked for, everything you've wanted? It's hurting people. People hurt people, Josh. This, this is helping people. By killing someone? Everybody dies. It's a means to an end. We're just helping them along. It wants too much. Everything is changing. Everything's always changing. It's the serpent shedding its skin. It's Eve giving Adam the apple. It's been with you since the beginning of time. Apple. That's right. You think you can take it on? It's too late. We're in business together, and the numbers are climbing. I never asked for this. This is exactly what you asked for. I want out. I wish I could help. You signed a contract. You made a deal. I never read it. They never do. I want out. Josh, let me remind you of all of that amazing footage of you and Miss Lee in the garage. Torture, kidnapping, electricity. Oh, that, that was good. I own you. I lived as 300 million strong because of your glowing endorsement. You work for me now. Josh, you're so close. Be the man you're destined to be. Take it. Or your life ends.